All right, so as you should be aware, this Friday, April 12th, is when we get the Avatar Elements collaboration. And that should include a mini battle pass as well, but I'll do a video on that later this week as we get closer to Friday. However, tomorrow we get a surprise in the item shop as officially announced by Fortnite. So let me show you their tweet and then we'll look at the mini teaser trailer that they put in game. So this is what it says, yip yip, get ready, Avatar, the last airbender is coming to Fortnite. Katara, Zuko, and Toph land in the shop tomorrow. And then they followed that up by saying, and start warming up your bending technique, Avatar Elements kicks off April 12th at 9 a.m. Eastern. So we got word early this morning that three skins were coming to the shop tomorrow, but nobody knew what it was. Everyone was speculating that it would be Avatar, but then a lot of people said, why would they release them early when the event is on Friday? There's no way it's going to be Avatar stuff. And it turns out it is Avatar stuff because they listed all three skins in this tweet. So the three Avatar skins, again, are Katara, Zuko, and Toph. And we can actually see them in the teaser trailer. So let me just play it for you here and then we'll break it down. Here you go. So that was a pretty short teaser trailer. I'm hoping there's a more full version come tomorrow, but we'll see. So we get a nice opening shot here of the giant iceberg, which of course holds Aang as well as Appa. And it shows Katara, the waterbender, walking up to it. Then we get a close-up version of Aang and Appa in there, and you can actually visit the iceberg on the map right now, which is kind of cool. It's getting closer and closer to the island. So then Katara puts her hand up against the iceberg and you hear it start to crack and then boom, it opens. I don't think that's how it happened in the show, but I know she helps Aang get out of there. And then the next parts go really, really quick, but we get a brief glimpse of Toph. She's both an earth bender as well as a metal bender, but we see her bending earth right here. Then it cuts to Katara, the water bender, and of course we have the water bending mythic in the game already. And then we got a brief shot of Zuko, the fire bender. So all three of these skins are gonna be in the item shop tomorrow and they're gonna cost 2,000 V-Bucks a piece. So hopefully they get bundled with all sorts of accessories because 2,000 a piece, that's a lot. Now from what I read, there's only gonna be one emote. So in this trailer, again, we saw earth bending, we already have the water bending mythic, and then we saw fire bending. So maybe one of those could be an emote and the other is gonna be a mythic, or maybe there's gonna be two more mythics coming this Friday, I don't know. But we clearly see the water bending, the earth bending, and the fire bending. So I'm not sure, again, if one of these is just an emote or if they're actual mythics that are gonna be added as well. So I don't know much about Avatar, but some of these seem like pretty solid skins. I know Toph is a really, really sweet character. So let me just show you the iceberg just in case you haven't been there yet, but it's right here. I think you even get a secret quest if you land on it. To be honest, I didn't land on it yet. It used to be way farther out, and then it's gradually getting closer and closer and closer to the island until this Friday. But like I said, I haven't even landed there once, so let's see if the secret challenge is even still active. Oh yeah, it's way closer to the island now. Check that out. Looks like there's even loot on it. I didn't know that. I see at least two chests. Wait, is that a rare chest on top? I wonder if that always spawns there if I just got super lucky here. Oh yeah, there's the visit the iceberg. When the world needed him most, he vanished. Nice. So we can see inside there just a little bit. There is Aang himself, and then his loyal Sky Bison, Appa, right there. Pretty cool. So this follows the show pretty closely because there was a hundred year war and Aang was frozen in an iceberg for a hundred years. And this is the very iceberg. And then with the help of Katara, he later emerged, but he was still biologically 12 years old. So Aang is just a little 12 year old kid in there. And he had to end the war that was going on by mastering the other three elements because he was the airbender. He needed the other three elements to defeat the Fire Lord, Ozai. Pretty cool. So Aang should be emerging this Friday during the event. I wonder if we're going to get some kind of full-fledged trailer or if something's going to happen with this iceberg in game, like a live event. I don't know. It should be pretty sweet regardless of what they do. So there you go. We got three skins coming tomorrow. Again, Katara, the waterbender. We've got Toph the Earthbender and Metalbender, and then Zuko the Firebender, all coming to the shop tomorrow night. I will have a full gameplay and review on all three of them tomorrow, so stay tuned for that. In the meantime, you can check out the Frozen Aang as well as Appa on the Iceberg if you come here. So there you go. 
that's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. Like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is Tabor Time.